Amanda Kathleen, my love, my best friend, my everything. I'm not sure I can write down everything that you mean to me in just a few short minutes, but I'm going to try with three exclamation points. <laughs> From the beginning, I knew this was something special between us. Your compassion, your wit, your humor, your selflessness, your love for family, and a million things that I could continue to list, but we don't have all day. You complete me. You truly do not know where I would be without you. 1,554 days ago, you decided to go on a journey with me, and I'm so thankful for that. From Brumo to Bridgewater to our new home in Marlton, I cannot thank you enough for being by my side along the way. I love our life and cannot wait to build a family. I vow to always make you laugh. I promise to always be your sounding board. I vow to support you, inspire you, and love you always. I promise to be a steady rock in turbulent times. I promise to never stop loving you. I pledge to always put you above everyone else. I promise to be the best friend, your partner, your biggest supporter, and your wife. I vow to go on endless adventures and never stop chasing the best life we can have. I promise to constantly work for us and grow our marriage every day. I promise to always make sure there are chocolate sprinkles in the pantry and coffee ice cream in our freezer. I promise to be the best mom to our future kids and our crazy fur child. I pledge to be the best husband and father to our baby, our fur baby, and our future kids. Over the last four years, three months, and two days, you have shown me what a great love looks like. And every morning I wake up and fall more in love with you. See you at the altar. Love, Matt. The fact of the matter is that love is always going to grow in adversity, struggle, or longing. If it does not, we can't really speak of it as being true love. You are my one and only today and every day. I love you and I can't wait to see you. See what this crazy life brings us. Love always. Amanda.